But you don't know how your animal is going to respond to it. Veterinarians at the U of I are warning people to watch how they handle the use of marijuana around pets. They have had at least two cases of what was likely marijuana intoxication in pets, and that's why they're reminding people to be careful. WCI3's Courtney Bunting joins us now. All right, Courtney, pot has been legal in Illinois for 15 days. They've had two cases. Is that a concern for them at this point? Well, Jessica, they say it hasn't been legal long enough for them to really know, but in other states where it has been legalized, they've reported an increase in those cases. Now, if you have marijuana in your house, it could be easy to leave it out on the table and not think about it. But experts recommend thinking of marijuana the same way you think about medication. So keep your, kill, your pills in a medicine cabinet and do the same with your pot. And you know that dogs like to take desserts off the table, and they're not just—they don't discriminate. <laughs> they don't, it doesn't matter how it tastes; uh, they're gonna—they're gonna eat it if uh, if it, it seems interesting to them. So you really do have to be careful. You can't assume that they won't like, you know, pot brownies or whatever whatever you've got. The risks for animals if they do ingest marijuana are significant. Some will act lethargic. It could also lower their heart rate. And in some cases, they'll go into comas, or in really extreme cases, they could die. Now, the increase in calls for possible marijuana intoxication in some of those states, as well as here, could also be linked to people just feeling more comfortable reporting it now that it's legal. Jessica. All right, Courtney, thank you. If you think your animal has been exposed to marijuana, the best thing to do is to take your animal to a vet if you think they're in danger, you can also call your vet if it's during normal business hours to talk with them about it first. Or you can call the ASPCA's Poison Control Hotline and they will help you figure out if your pet needs medical care immediately. All right.